But first, I want to catch up with an extremely talented crafter who I've been obsessed with since she custom designed our studio entrance. London K crochets elaborate art installations called Yarn Bombs in unexpected places. Her work's so good, it's even been recognized by the Smithsonian, not too shabby. On International Women's Day, London revealed her latest piece in Washington, D.C., a yarn mural of Vice President Kamala Harris. Let's check in with her right now. What's up, London? Yo, what's up? It's good to see you. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. That that mural is amazing. Like what inspired you to do that? Oh my gosh, this is part of a huge project called Love Across the USA, celebrating great American women from history through modern day. It was started by a fiber artist in 2017 named Olick, and they're actually the reason I started yarn bombing in the first place. There's been six murals done like this before. But in December of 2020, they came to me and asked if I officially wanted to take over Love Across the USA, and I enthusiastically said yes. I hit the ground running and announced on Instagram on Inauguration Day if any crocheters wanted to help make a mural celebrating Kamala Harris. And 150 crocheters from around the country responded and came together to make this mural happen. It created a kind of community in this time of COVID too. So, so fun. Oh my God, it's so cool. So what were each of the crafters responsible for? Everyone was responsible for a two foot by two foot square. So we did a big Zoom kickoff call where everybody could come together and I could make sure everyone knew exactly how to crochet their square. From there, I paired people up with a pattern piece based on their crochet skill set level and also what yarn they had at home. And uh, the crocheting began. I flew to Washington, D.C., ended up stitching all of the squares together to create a 40-foot mural that went up on March 8th, International Women's Day, and it'll be up through Memorial Day at the District Wharf in Washington, D.C. I think the coolest part is that it wasn't done by just one person. I love that so many powerful women put this thing together for a powerful woman. It's, it's a really cool thing. Um, thank you so much, London. Thank you so much. More to come, for sure. Want more fun stuff? I thought so. Check out these videos floating around my head. This one is really cool. I'm just saying. No pressure.